Dredging a harbor may seem like drudgery, but it's actually pretty cool. Like a giant claw machine where every chance wins you dirt and gets you closer to the prize. The prize being able to move your ships in and out of dock without running aground. We're assisting our Army partners here at the Watercraft Maintenance Facility in cleaning up the debris at the bottom of the uh, wet storage area. The project began with divers and uh, cranes, and now we're at another phase of the project where we have a dredging device here to, to be able to pull the sediment from the bottom. You see, over time, ocean currents and changing tides, as well as wind, bring material to the space where it gets trapped in the wet storage area, raising the seabed and the, the, the depth for ships slowly starts getting shallower and shallower. So over time, you need to do maintenance dredging every so often to restore some of the buffer that they need to move their vessels around safely. So after the dredging is done and the sediment is relocated out to sea and out of harm's way, soldiers can feel safe to pull into port once again. This is just another example of the way that the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers is out here to support the Army and our other service branch members and keeping them ready and resilient to do their mission. Reporting from Yokohama North Dock, I'm Charlie Mabe, U.S. Army Garrison, Japan.